Hello, Musto0063, back for part 38 of NAFKA, not another falling game. Last time I clear, I did, uh, got past the first 10 screens of stage 20 with the um, rising spike floor, which has been uh, been a lot of fun. Also um, spent quite a bit of time on the, the secret uh, or the card um, screen for stage 20. That was getting a little bit frustrating, but still not that bad. Certainly not the worst of the uh, secret card areas by far. Um, although I'm, I'm thinking back on it, I managed to clear stage 19's one quicker that will just that just astounds me <laughs> that will continue to astound me for quite some time but uh yeah anyway got through the first half of stage 20 and uh yeah let's uh kick off with the second or the kick off with the second set or well, the last 10 screens of stage 20 or at least hopefully we can get that far I'm not saying i'm not saying that's definitely gonna happen by this time but uh yeah we'll kick off with the 11th one uh and this one was one previously where i had to destroy a whole uh, bunch of copy kits, which are strangely omitted or yeah, not present here. So I assume it's just going for the warp, which means I don't have to back, don't have to muck around in in certain areas. Yeah, which would be dead ends. I can just uh, make my way to the warp as quick as possible. Yeah, cool, nice. A mirror kit, okay, and. Switches and various bits and pieces. Okay, so we have to get the, the switch in the middle first, then the one at the top. That's going to be fun with the, that wall jumping there. Hoi. Okay, well I guess we're just going to progress and we'll see what uh, see what happens as, as we go as we go forward. I'm relieved to see the uh, spike wall is uh, somewhat uh, slow because that's going to be help because that's certainly helpful. And uh, yeah, the uh, yeah. The, uh, the, the, the switch uh, on the wall jump, obviously on the left hand side, although I'm looking at the, uh, I'm looking at the, the kid on the right hand side, given the, uh... see why am I bothering with that, let's just do that, just make things easier for myself. I'm looking at the uh, right hand side to see if I can not hit, in fact I don't need to bother with the left hand uh, wall jump, do I, or do I? Surely not, no. Yeah, I'm looking on the right hand side with the... <laughs> But I am, I am gonna. I don't know actually. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna do that. That bottom bit how I see it, frankly. Oh, come on. No, you know what? Yeah, we're gonna do that. Yeah, that's fine. Anyway, I'm pay, trying to pay attention to. Oh, what? Um, I want to know how it's possible for the kid to get on the wall jump. And for the mirror kid not to have, because we should be in completely symmetrical position. So, given what am I doing at the bottom here? Given that the kid got up to the to the right of that mini spike uh, on the shaft on the right, and on the and on the opposite side of the screen is the switch. How did the mirror kid not get it? I don't understand. <laughs> Is that three? Is that a counter there for for saying ultimate? Yeah, I think it is, isn't it? The three seconds I've got between hitting the first switch and the second switch. That's that doesn't give me a lot of time to prepare. But why do I keep hitting that mini that low mini spike there? Yeah, and I've run out of time then. That was annoying. The one time I actually uh, did, I got it sorted, I uh, ran out of time. The uh, the other switch uh, deactivated, uh, and I had no chance because yeah, the spike uh, the spike uh, spike floor was uh, very high up. Oh come on! I'm just failing on just nonsense at the moment. Again, he didn't. He didn't do it. He didn't climb the wall. I fail to see how he could possibly not. I think I was too late again. I f unless the other switch deact. What? Did you see what happened to the mirror kid there? If you did not go back and look at that, he got stuck at the bottom. He act he actually got stuck on the bottom of the screen. I have no idea how that's possible. If we are, a, and, and, and it, yeah, it's the same as the switch. It's a, if we're a complete mirror image, and yeah, we are exactly the same position away from the wall when we start, 
then I do not see how it's possible for the mirror kid to do one thing and the kid to do something different. Man, I cannot get that wall jump, um, that wall jump bit on the right hand side of those mini spikes correct at all. Just, kid keep, just keeps hitting one of them. <sighs> really? Right. I still got to get back in here though, haven't I? I've got to kill him off. Oh man! quick do I have to be? I'm going to pause here because I was a bit quicker. No, 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 you don't. I almost failed the double jump on the wall there and that would have been disastrous. Yeah, I, I went a little bit quicker at the beginning there and not resting in between the gate jumps. So I was going through one and then going through another one. That gave me just a little bit of extra time. I wasn't risking it on the final go though because I still felt I had enough time. But my double jump almost failed when I was going up to, to grab that wall jump. That would have been disastrous. Oh. <laughs> right. This is interesting. Oh. Oh, man. Wow. That is, uh, that is going to be a, 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 an annoying last, last set of jumps. I think I wasn't aligned properly there. That was my problem there. Yeah, that's all still fine. There's no real issue until here. Okay, I'm jump, still jumping too late, I think, there. Yeah, getting, a, getting the timing for this. Tricky, and then you have, the water is almost, gonna, is, is almost certain to be not there when I make the jump up. I jumped too early there. Or maybe I set off too early? I think I'm setting off too early, actually. Because I can still... Wow! I can still yeah, I can still make the water. And now the water is going to be down lower uh, before the spike wall gets too high. I'm still going to have to pull off... I do not like that, though. That that's, looks nasty. But yeah, I think I actually maybe need to set off a little bit later. Just so the spike wall is not quite so high up quite so soon. But man, that, that last, that last uh, manoeuvre where I've got to weave through those spikes, I don't see how I'm going to do that with the water still around. <sighs> the water is going to be away and getting the timing to move through the, those spikes is going to be horrible. I mean, the, the timing is set in stone up to this point in time. Seriously. Yeah, that last maneuver is the uh, is the is the bugger in this in this screen. Seriously, and I and I'm rushing. I'm I'm trying to unnecessarily. Well, maybe not unnecessarily, but I'm trying to rush uh, this bit here to try and get down just a little bit quick. Oh, that was actually oh, that was actually I actually had more time there than I thought I did. Maybe I was a bit quicker in, the, in, in this section here and afforded myself a bit more time by not resting on that platform. Oh, I think, yeah. Okay, I think I'm actually giving myself just a little bit of extra time there if I am quick in, in, uh, in this next section. I jumped too early, Blair. But that's the problem. I'm going to try, I'm going to be trying to pinch as much time as I can get now. But of course, I need to not jump too early here that I can't reach the water. Oh, good grief. I should not be not be clipping any spikes while going up there. I know I'm rushing, I know I'm going quickly, but still! That's still annoying though. Those, that plane, if you want to call it that, it's probably not quite as bad as a standard plane, but oh, I didn't double jump for some reason, I have no idea why. Um, but yeah, those downward planes there are, yeah, I mean they're no, yeah, calling them a plane is probably too much, they're not planes per se, but <laughs> They're still awkward, though. Let's put it that way. I think I should have had that, that go. I really think I should have had that. Oh, I waited on the... I, I didn't fall off the ledge. Fantastic. <laughs> I probably still could have done it, but that wasn't going to help any, was it? No! 
Man, those are maneuvers at the end are annoying. And there's not even any any need really to wow to feel like I need to rush that section either because the spike the spike the spike floor is nowhere near me for that last section. Or at least I don't think it is anyway. No, the spike the spike floor is not a problem there. Provided I don't mess around at the, at the beginning areas, the spike the spike floor is not an issue. I keep clipping that that the, the top spike. I'm obviously just moving too soon when trying to pull that off. And yeah, overcompensate, obviously, cl <laughs> clearly. Need to find the happy medium. Whoa! Okay, I've, I've stuffed this going things. I, 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 you know what? I possibly could have done that if I hadn't, if I'd actually thought. If I'd actually a pre, if I'd actually realised I still would have had time to do that, I think I've messed up, messed, messed this up again. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm not reaching the, the water with my double jump, but I'm still reaching it on the way down, well, because the water is catching up to me. So, but I'm, I'm losing some time. Really? Ugh. No, that's just I don't even know what I'm doing there. There's no reason to not do an extra double jump. The water's there. I nearly did it again for no for no reason whatsoever, despite literally s actually speaking the sentence to say there's no reason not to do that. So I'm clearly getting down here before the water's anywhere before I need to make this jump. Got it. Fine. Okay. Good. That was starting to get a little frustrating. Not gonna lie, but that last manoeuvre was was pretty tricky. And here we've got the cloaking. Don't know how thrilled I am about. What? What am, um, what am I? What am I dying on? Here. What am I actually dying on? Um. Seriously. What? Huh? I. I. What? I. I. What? What? What's going on here? Uh. What actually is going on here? Oh, Way too late. Wow. I can only assume that I'm trying to move off the wall jump. Or I'm not on the wall jump. Or something. But now what, what the hell? I actually don't see. I'm finding it really, right, again, there. I'm finding it really, really difficult to even see what I'm dying on. I'm, I, what, I, why do I keep getting stuck there as well? Oh my God, that is going to be, that is, that is going to be so awkward. I, I, seriously, I actually think I'm I, I'm thinking that I'm way higher up the wall jump than I am, but I, I, I just don't know what I'm 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 assuming I'm dying on this bottom spike. What all the time? I, but I just I don't understand. Blind wall jumping is is just uh, wow. I don't even know what to say. If I got my jump there at the bottom, I'd have done that. And I'm really, really hoping that I can that that, um, that I can kind of pull this off pretty quickly because this is a uh, oh no. This seriously, this first section here, trying to blind wall jump is horrible. <laughs> got it. Okay. I'm pleased to have that one out of the way. Blind wall jumping there was was really really awkward. I mean, I assuming a lot of my desks were just failing to appreciate when I'd landed back on the wall, and obviously not not getting any jump, just falling to my death on the spikes. But yeah, no, blind wall jumping is a right royal pain <laughs> for someone who's not even um, especially great at wall jumping. Or I'd like to think I'm okay now, but. 
blind wall jumping. It's just, um, no. <laughs> Oh no, please don't. No, please don't tell me I've got to pull off a silly... Okay, maybe it's not that silly, I don't know. That is a bit irritating though. I'm not, I'm not fond of having to pull off what looks like... Okay, I can ignore that one. That's helpful. I get myself a light... No, ding it! I should have had that. This actually isn't as bad as I thought it was. I, th I honestly thought that the, um, the platforms were going to be uh, more um, problematic and I'd have to sort of do the, uh, yes, the, uh, the sort of, the double, get the double jump ones off them, which I'm never good at. So um, I'm relieved to see that ultimately you could, that, that, that didn't seem to be a factor there. So, cool. Okay. Five down, we are into the final five, and I've been jumping to hit the save, and my jump counter has been going up. <laughs> so let's reset that, and try again. And obviously try and uh, get through this with uh, conserving my jumps as much as possible. Not at the expense of doing stupid things like that, though. Ah, uh, no, I'm not going to have to jump for the port for the uh, warp, though, am I? So, there's a possibility that would have been all right. I, I think I need to do slightly better in the middle, though. I think I was, uh, well, I definitely messed that up. <laughs> I think I'm taking a few too many jumps in the middle. Well, there we go again. I need to hit the switch, though. Okay, let's not, let's, let's not try and be too cute. Let's just, let's just try and do it. How I'm currently, really? How I'm currently doing it? If I run out of jumps, then um, so be it. We'll have to we'll have to think of a, of a quicker way of doing it. But again, if I don't, if I don't need to conserve my jumps quite as much as as it looks like I might need to, then uh, and I can get away with it. Then uh, yeah, let's not. Oh no! I certainly don't. I had two jumps left there, and I did not need to jump again. I can't believe I clipped the uh, spike on the, to the left of the switch. Uh, that was pathetic. I'm actually one jump uh, down here, but I still think, well, I still think I would, I, I would yeah, I would have been okay. Because, yeah, the goal, the goal I should have done that, I had two jumps left. So all I need to do, really, is not be, not panic now. Take my time. Wow! <laughs> Take my time a bit more. Oh my goodness. Yeah, no, I'm one jump down here again. But I, I don't know what I'm doing here. Honestly, this is... The, the gaps and such like that are not that, are not that difficult, are small to get through here. I've got way more time than I think I have. I mean, I didn't need to jump there. <laughs> I didn't mean to jump there either, really, but still managed to get through. Oh, I've got infinite jump here, of course, haven't I? And, uh, yay for this first manoeuvre. Well, oh, okay, fine. Oh, I, for some reason, didn't appreciate the, uh, okay, that first manoeuvre is actually, uh, fine. I can't believe I'm actually going to say this, but maybe it's not fine. We'll see now. After beating it, yeah, lovely. After two first goes, and then uh, literally the next however many... Now, after, without success, that's unbelievable. Um, yeah, I, you're not going to believe what I'm just about to say, but I actually didn't appreciate that the uh, I had to do this quickly because there was a spiked floor chasing me. Uh, I know that sounds absolutely ludicrous. How could I possibly have forgotten this stage's gimmick? But absolutely legitimately, I was so focused on just almost that first manoeuvre uh, and then the, uh, the spike weaving on the left-hand side that, uh, yeah, I completely plum forgot. Uh, that, of course, I need to go quickly, probably more so uh, anywhere else than down this uh, weave, which is easier said than done. But yeah, I need to do it quickly because, uh, yeah, I've got a spike uh, floor chasing me, but there's still plenty, to, plenty of time and uh, with no real problem uh, at all either. Right, three to go. Let's get the elevator. Let's, no, actually, let's go in there first and then set the elevator off, otherwise I'm going to be a bit stuffed. Oh, come on. Ding it. That was bad. I should be a bit ahead of time now here because I didn't quite appreciate where I needed to 
didn't it? Didn't get out of the of the, of the, of the area. But uh, I've got an infinite jump as well, of course, haven't I? So yes, again, I didn't really forget that, but because obviously I'm not going to make that otherwise. But okay, cool. We're done. Nice and easy that one. This one. Could, oh, whoops. <laughs> Yeah, spike, spike floor. Spike floor coming up from underneath me. Might be a good idea to, you know, get high. <laughs> wow. <laughs> this one could be fun. Again, I, 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 may, I raised the issue of, uh, you know, like uh, previously, I mean, not, not in that case, so just, uh, that, that one was still with on my radar, but yeah, I did raise the issue uh, the opposite, going the opposite direction, but yeah, the, the spike, um, ceiling then or now it's just now oh no now it's the floor uh does do a very good job of hiding the fruit so it does get quite difficult toward the end because you can't really see them coming um as quick and as uh as, as oh i need i i need to do roughly what i'm doing there the last two times but just not jump um not jump again there and just drop dip down a little bit more i think i should be fine if i can get that sorted but uh yeah it, it's 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 obvious that I can't quite see things coming as... Uh, in fact, I'm going to go over that. Can't quite... Wow, that one moving horizontally there is annoying, because the timing there was just... I was about to make my move for the for the wall. But, uh, yeah, I said, well, I don't think it's too bad, but, uh, yeah, the... Wow. As I get sniped. It is difficult to, to, to fully appreciate where the fruit are coming from, uh, you know, at, and the, when, the, when the count is almost done. Cool. Exclamation mark, question mark, question mark. Let's go. Wow, okay. Oh, dang it, man. Bet you I don't get anywhere near that far in the next 10 goes. Gonna call it now. That's two. Three. Four. Five. Yep. Six. What? Seriously, what can I say? I mean, we're not at ten yet. That was the deal I made, but seven. But, again, I don't want to say beginner's luck. Eight. I don't want to say beginner's luck, because nine. Because nothing here... I don't, 10, there you go. I didn't, I don't, I've got past this bottom bit. <laughs> After the first uh, 12 now. Um, but seriously, there's just 13. There's just something to be said for, for like the first go I do, I, I attempt something. It's, it's unbelievable. How can I get that far through? First go and then I, I haven't even got past the bottom bit. The next, I think it was 14, was it? 14 or 15 goes. I didn't get past this spike here. That's amazing. Absolutely amazing. Ah, oh, come on. I can't even actually remember what I died on now either. I think it was something fairly stupid. Oh, it was a, it was a, it was a jump. I know, it was a jump over a, a twin spikes, wasn't it? Which is, uh, I'd be pretty uh, mortified to die to with, without an infinite jump. But, um, Although, frankly, not that the infinite jump really makes much difference there, because I'm still, I'm just going to do that the way I would normally do it, with a jump and then a double and then another jump. But, yeah, I'm pretty mortified whenever I die to those anyway, so, um, oh, come on. <laughs> yeah, to get, to get that far to mess up on that jump, of all things, and then, however many it's been, probably at least 30 by now, and not even get anywhere close to that again. Just, Wow. And there's, there's no rhyme or reason behind it, other than, what, adrenaline at seeing the stage first off? Because <laughs> the gate jumps, yeah, all the gate jumps I've been failing on at the, uh, now are just, are just awful. Seriously. Admittedly, that is a diamond, I suppose, rather than a gate jump, so it's, 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 it's a little bit more tricky, but... Still... First go was was awesome until I died really stupidly. Everything after that has been pathetic. Including that. 
I know there's a spike on the ceiling there that I want to be wary about not hitting, but for goodness sake. Low enough to not make the ledge is just, I'll say again, pathetic. Wow, really? This, this should have been a first goer because now, and I'm going to try my best not to get frustrated with what I, you know, should be possibly the last screen in the entire game. If there's nothing extra after this, this will be. This is screen uh, 200, the 20th screen of stage 20. There were 10 stages originally, so potentially this could be the last screen in the game. So. Now, I would, I'd, I'd really like to not get frustrated on it, but again, having got so far on the first go, the fact that I now cannot get anywhere near it is really actually starting to piss me off. Because, again, it's, it's a sort of a difficulty of thinking, well, it can't be that bad then, can it? Because first go, I got such a long way through it. There's clearly nothing here that should be too tricky, but honestly, after that first go, I have this has been pathetic. I know they're not give, these maneuvers are not gimmies, but just how can I be so bad at these? At, in particular, the gate jumps. I'm telling you, I better pull it off. I don't know what, I don't know, I, or I can't remember, because I'm assuming it's obviously, you know, effectively an upside down version of, of, of screen 200, uh, sorry, screen 200 in stage 10. I can't remember what the, uh, what came after that. I remember the, the, the very last bit is effectively just a walk down a, a corridor, and hopefully I've got enough time uh, to get to the walk, but... Yeah, I don't remember. Oh my goodness. I don't remember any specific uh, maneuvers that I'm going to have to pull off. But I seriously hope the next time I get back up to where I died that I pull it off. Pull off the rest and there's nothing tricky. Because look at this. Seriously. How can I not get annoyed with this now? After that first go. This is just pathetic. I mean, seriously. I'm, 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 I'm really at, I'm, I'm, I'm trying my best. I'm not, I'm, I'm getting frustrated. I'm not getting to the point where I'm pissed off yet. Let's just say that. But, I mean, seriously, it's just, could you blame me? I'm actually questioning even how I do that gate jump now with the mini spikes on the floor. I feel like that is actually the most awkward of the gate jumps, thanks to those bloody mini spikes on the floor. But I'm I'm thinking about I don't know why I'm overthinking it or trying to think of a strategy. It's just it is it is a gate jump. I know how to do gate jumps, or I'd like to think I do. I cannot believe. Uh, this is, uh, and seriously, this could end the game on a really annoying, sour note for me. Unless I start getting good soon. Because, wow. I, if, uh, seriously, if I hadn't got that far first go, I wouldn't think any, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be thinking anything like this. I wouldn't be getting any, uh, w wow. I, I wouldn't be getting, I wouldn't be getting anywhere near annoyed. And I'm going to use the phrase pissed off now because I am getting slightly pissed off. If I hadn't got that far first go, I'd just be sort of saying, okay, yeah, this one's this one. Admitted, admittedly so, you know, probably with good reason, if it is the last screen of the game, uh, is quite difficult. But, you know, I've got nothing to compare it to. But, first go, getting that far. I, I, I can't do that, I can't do that manoeuvre. First go, getting that far, is just, has just completely sort of raised my expectations in terms of thinking, this can't be, this can't be that difficult. It really can't. And I can't, and I cannot, for the life of me, do it. I'm even wondering whether I should, at this point in time, 
sort of take a break and come back to it. I can't believe I'm even suggesting that on screen 200, the final screen of the game, which I would obviously just love to get done now. Don't worry, it will get done this video, even if I have to cut, because I've run out of a... Uh, I've run out of a rant uh, to, 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 to go on, but I, I can't do that. I can't do that maneuver there, and I just I can't I can't do I can't do what I did first time off without even batting an eyelid at it. It's it's insane. It's absolutely insane. Yeah, this is this is starting to leave a sour a sour taste. Because, how do I do that manoeuvre? I, I, how do I do that manoeuvre? I mean, I need to dip like I'm doing a regular gate jump. Obviously not quite so low that I'm hitting the mini, that I hit the mini spikes, presumably. But, I just can't get the hang of it at all. I, I can't get the hang of this at all. Why could I, why could I not have just done this, like, literally first go? I, di I actually did this screen on the, on the original stage 10. Uh, very quickly. I don't think it was like I don't think it was first go, but I'd have to I'd have to go back and check. Maybe it even was. I don't know, but I did it very quickly within the first five goes, I'd say. Um, and yeah, first go here, first go here was amazing until I died stupidly onto a place where I should never, never die, and I haven't been able to get anywhere near since. Or I've got back somewhat near once. And then made another complete colossal mess of it. Right. Oh, goodness me, what am I doing? Oh, no! Oh, that ending! That ending! Oh man, I mean it's not like they're that narrow either, but there's, there's still plenty of room in there, but I almost sort of saw the spike um, floor out of the corner of my eye as well, and I was like, oh my god, I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to do that pretty quickly as well. Oh my goodness, that ending. Yeah, of course, the, the I mean, the, the original version, with it, with it being upside down, all those spikes were on the ceiling, and I could just walk under them. Clearly not uh, when it's this side up. They were actually, I mean, then they didn't look like they were positioned um, so close together like it's, you know, like a pixel perfect landing or a two pixel uh, perfect landing zone or anything like that. So that's something. Um, but, man, with a spike wall chasing me uh, and, in, and uh, yeah, just a kind of a neat feeling like I need to rush, I could do without that ending. I also messed up my timing here, or messed up just the infinite jump up here for some stupid reason. So I've got more time now than I had last time, but... Yes! Cool! Okay, that last screen was, I can't deny, starting to piss me off. But <laughs> oh boy, just seriously, I, I so wish I'd not got that far first go. I could have done that first go, because I honestly died right at the top there. But after where I died the first time, the rest was plain sailing. The only thing I died on after that point was, well, the only thing I did was one death at the very top of the screen. I'm going to come out of there because the screen shaking might be very annoying for you. <laughs> it's annoying for me to look at as well, actually, so let's get out of there. Um, yeah, I, I just so wish I hadn't got that far first go. Okay. I'm, I've, I've done that quick enough now to the point where I don't feel like I've got a sour taste in my mouth or anything like that. I don't feel too annoyed. <laughs> a little tiny bit, but not so much that I'm, you know, like, oh my god, I hate this game now. Why did you make me do this at the end? Rah. But, um, yeah, no, I, I, I so wish I'd not got that far first go. Because that just completely distorted my expectations of that, of, of that screen in terms of thinking, oh, it's, it's easy. When if, I was having an absolute shocker. On the, on, the, on the first two sections of it. Wow. But anyway, it's done. And as the kid says here, all clear. Now it's time to save Stephanie, who's spelt wrong. Secrets? Oh, I need to collect the cards. I should have them all. If I've missed one, I'm going to be super annoyed. 
This portal grants you temporary ability to walk back to this room. Okay, fine. To activate select, hold W key for a while, blah, 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 blah. Since you'll be collecting cards from previous stages, this ability might be useful. Well, again, I'm hoping I have them all. I don't recall missing any. I have collected all the cards. Now what? Great job, I'm very pleased. Now go activate your invention. Oh, okay. Okay, we can't go through there. I'm assuming we're going left this time. That's one place where, yeah, where we previously haven't gone. This has previously been completely out of bounds, both this time around with the, with the screen this way up, and indeed when we were ac accessing stages 7 to 10, I think, the other way up. This, 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 this way had always been out of bounds behind this, so yeah, it's time to finally see what's behind here. More rooms. Before we revive Anna, I'd like to say a few things. Congratulations, you have managed to survive this difficult experiment. You only died 10,176 times. I'm slightly disappointed I couldn't get this in under 10,000. That would have been a lo that would have been a nice milestone to have actually got. But um, um, I was going to reveal my death counter and indeed time spent on this game when it's when when on when it's concluded. I was going to show my save file. Um, but um, yeah, there it is. I mean, this I don't. Yeah, who, is there some more to come? I don't know. But uh, yeah, as at, as at now. Yes, I'm looking at the top of the screen, um, which clearly says my time and death. And yes, indeed, it is 10,176. So, yeah, I'm ever so, ever so slightly disappointed I couldn't get, uh, couldn't do it in under 10,000. But, oh, well, it's it's pretty good, I think, for me on a blind on a blind run of this game. This has been this has been difficult. This has been much more difficult than Nang. And I will and I will come back to that point uh, later. Nice job. I love your patience. Yeah, no kidding. Now, to revive Anna, you need your memory back. Listen closely, your name is Isaac, kid. We are reversing the gravity again. Interesting. Can I go back this way? Do I want to go back up there? I presume I can't get back down, and if that's the case, I probably don't want to do that. Let's... Unless there's an achievement for doing that, I don't know. <laughs> Even if there is, I'm not overly fussed to the point where... You know, you know what? If I have to cycle through the text again, I will. But curiosity is just completely gone the best best of me. No, it looks like I'm going to be stuck because I can't go down. I can't go down platforms. It's not like Nang, where the the, the, the moment we enter stage eleven, we'll be able to go down by holding the down button on platform. So yeah, this is inaccessible. I can't get in there. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do, I'll have to, I'll have to cycle through that again. No big deal, I can do that quickly. But um, yeah, uh, okay, fair enough. Not unexpected, but it was just begging to be checked. And who knows, I might have even got, there may have been some sort of silly achievement um, for doing so. So yeah, it had to be done. It had to, I had to at least investigate that possibility. Yeah, it didn't take us that long to get back here, did it? So with that out of the way, let's progress clearly where the game wants me to go. <laughs> this is all very ominous. Oh, blimey. Let's start, Isaac. Oh, okay. Activate Anna. Remember, guy, things don't always work out as planned. What do you mean? I can't stop you, but Anna can. Walk towards cell. Well, again, I guess I'm stuck on here. I guess I'm stuck here. Okay. Where am I? I'm liking these sprites here for these people. Anna! Anna! I did it! I finally revived you! Holy crap! You look freaking scary. Guy? Wait, what happened? Guy revived you by combining your memory with the AI I developed. He sacrificed much, even friends. Anna, please stop him. Stephanie is in danger. <laughs> I did it. Guy, what have you done? <laughs> Guy! Yes, I did just slap myself. <laughs> Anna, look at what you have done. You hurt your friends and turned me into a robot. I am an abomination of your evil plan. No, Anna. You are, no, you are not an abomination. I am. I am the product of your sadness and madness. 
I cannot accept this, and you even put my best friend in danger. Where is Stephanie? She... she is fighting my robots. Shut down those robots. Okay, okay. I don't deserve this revival. Anna, and you're turned freakishly scary again. Guy, destroy me. Oh, really? No! Guy, look what you have turned yourself into. A monster of grief, hurting everyone you hold dear. You were not like this. It really hurts to see you act like this. Please, Guy, come back. Oh, the tea is there as well. <laughs> Anna! I'm already dead. You cannot revive me. Anna! Please, destroy me. No, I can't do it. I don't want to lose you again. You never lose me. I'm always in your heart. Aww. Thank you for all these years. I'm so satisfied to be your wife. Do it, Isaac. No! Do I actually have to kill you? Wow. Anna, no! Farewell, guy. No! Isaac! Whoa. Is that Stephanie? It's over, guy. Stephanie! Stephanie! Seems like I arrived just in time. Are you hurt? Where are Emily and Rimia? Probably so I've mispronounced that. There was Samir. I disassembled those robots right after I saw them. She's more powerful than I thought. It's not too late, guy. No one is harmed, so legally you didn't commit serious crimes. <laughs> Go to the police. It's not too late. I guess you're right. Um, oh, I was about to say, what was going on after that? <laughs> uh, presumably another set of end credits then? Cool. This is a really nice theme, by the way, as well. I'm looking forward to seeing what stages it references during the credits, assuming we go down that route again. So, Isaac Kidd, author Yom, Yom A. Apologies if I've, again, mispronounced that. Oh, the be oh, stage one at the beginning. Let's set this room up. Let's get this room set up, boys. An unfortunate accident. So we'll go back to stage one. Okay, are the credits longer this time? Guy, can't find me in the dark. I'll be safe here. Oh, I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to bother reading those out again for the first ten, because I think I've done this. But yeah, I've, I've done this before. So if there's new ones for, uh, if there's new ones for um, eleven to twenty, then I will do. But uh, yeah, the ones for four, uh, sorry, four. Wow, wow. The ones for one to ten are the same. Yeah, this is such a nice theme, by the way. Oh, the nostalgia of seeing all these stages. <laughs> Back when the game was a lot easier than it was in the second half. <laughs> Right. With stage 10 there. Is that the end? Or are we going to get some more? No. Okay. That's slightly disappointing. I would have liked to have seen another set of um, screens there for stages, for stages 11 to 20. Very, very, very minor nitpick though. True ending achieved. Oh, here we go. The reboot. Why am I dressed up like this? Ah, uh, a routine, probably. Stage 12 of darkness. Everyone starts working. We need to have this chamber finished by today. What? Me? Too scary. No way. That's not an excuse. You all know I'm handsome. 13, the room modified. Too weak. Yay! Mum is awesome! Oh my god, look at those battleships. They was deconstructed. I didn't read that in time. The Storm. I don't wonder why we don't have comic portraits. Do be a background character. Characters. Don't ask for more. Spelling. Stage 15, the trigger. This door is definitely worth investigating. Conclusion, it is a decoration. Okay. 16, the ocean. Ugh. Our boss builds us a swimming pool. Hooray! A terrifying swimming pool. Did not like stage 16. Ugh. Stage 17, the copy. What's this giant big red button on my body? Wait, don't press it. It is self-destruction. Sigh, why do we even add this functionality in the first place? Stage 18, the universe. Haha, <laughs> this fellowship is now 20% cooler. 
and 20% more brute force. <laughs> Portal 2, the cake is a lie if you cannot find it. That makes me think there is some kind of secret or achievement in stage 9 or 19 with cake. Stage 20, another ending. We are safe now. Where is Guy? He's with the police. Thanks for playing. Anna, I'm always with you. Anna, where are you? She just said she's always with you. I'm now part of the internet. You copied yourself to the internet? Exactly. I'm so worried about you, so I decided to stay. You really don't know how hard I managed to accept what I am now. Let's talk. I really have many things that I want to talk about. Okay, as always. A love story. Get the true ending. Okay. Let's investigate this. Am I effectively... Wait, what? Oh. Okay. Does that flip me upside down so that I would then do... Okay. Right, nice. You can now press up and down to skip floors. Skip from... Oh, okay. Skip from 178, for example, to 177 or 179. Talk to the doors for hints to open them. What? Open a stranger door in stage two. Oh my goodness, have we got a chi um, something extra to do then? Or are these the achievements? Are these the weird achievements? I bet you these are the weird achievements. I don't know whether or not I'm going to do that. I will... Have a think about that. I'm going to end this part here. This isn't going to be the last part of the Let's Play. I am going to, at the very least, have another part just to sum up my thoughts on the game as a whole and such like that and maybe decide whether or not I want to do that. I'm assuming those gates correspond to the, to the achievements and that I'd have to get all of them to get through there. But do I want to, do I want to actually do that? Is there anything extra over there worth doing? Let, let me just check by pressing F2, actually. I mean, I'm assuming when I start the game off, I'll be, I'll be back here. You can also see my save file as well, so you can see how long it took. So let's go back to the title screen, and let me just quickly count which doors are open. So it's what the first, the second one, and then three, four, five, six, seven, eight, the ninth one. Okay, so there are 12, uh, 12 doors here, and I've opened up the first, second, and ninth. Let's go back to the title screen, and then the um, achievements. So here's all my achievements for clearing stages 1 to 4, and then the harder version of 1 to 4, 5 to 6, and the upside down harder versions of, uh, sorry, 5 to 8, and the upside down harder versions. So we've got 9 and 10 here, I don't know what that one is then. So here's my two endings. I've got my walks a thousand miles achievement. I don't know what that is, whether that's a certain number of deaths or something? Feels like that would be hard, very hard to get. But okay, over here, so after the main bit, the main section, so these these ones here, we've got more achievements over here. And I have got, if we're going down, and we are going down, because, for example, let's go all the way back to the left. Apologies, but the first one is one, and the next one we get is two, three, four. So we are going down in columns, rather than across a little bit side to side or anything. So, looking at that... I've got the first, second, and the second one. I didn't get the third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, or eighth. So if the night, if the next one on the next column is got, I'm presuming that's what it corresponds to. And then we've got a 10, 11, 12, and we've still got four more achievements. So I'm assuming that's what that is then. But I now have a, I now have a something to debate about whether or not I want to bother doing that. I don't know what is additional. Oh, what potentially would allow me to get those other four achievements, for example. I've got no idea what this one here would be. This would be the other one that, would, you know, that I, from my money, wouldn't open up all those gates. So God knows what that one is. I don't know if it's a certain number of deaths or something. <sighs> or some... Yeah, yeah, no idea what that is. But, yeah, okay, it looks like then I have to get the other achievements. It does, it does give me hints, at least. So, so I know, for instance, this next one, 
this is a tutorial one. This one was on stage one. So it did say find a seat, an, a, a sort of an additional door or something on stage two. So it's just give you some hints as to where to look. And of course, I can now just skip screen to screen. I don't have to replay the whole. For example, if it's in stage, tw if it's in screen forty, which would be the twentieth one of stage two, I don't have to go all the way through screens uh, twenty-one to thirty-nine just to get to screen forty. I can now skip through floors. But yeah, I don't know whether or not I want to do this. So. Yeah, I'll leave, I will leave that there for now. There will definitely be an, at least in a one more part where at the very least I will do an epilogue just to sort of uh, give my thoughts on the game and everything like that. I may come back and do this, and that will be again in that part or in, in, perhaps even in parts if I decide to do it, but I'm not making any guarantees on that. So, yeah, I'm going to leave that there. I might be back for some, for some extra material and extra gameplay showing off to some of these achievements. I may decide... <sighs> I can't be bothered and we'll leave the game there. I certainly didn't do anything like this in Nang. I'm not sure there would have been anything, any other reason to do it in Nang. I feel like there's a reason to hunt these down in this game. Plus, the fact that I can skip from level to level to try and look for them is really nice. And again, I don't think I could do that in Nang. You can obviously go to the beginning of a, of a world or a stage, but I don't recall you being able to go to a specific level if you wanted to. So that does at least make hunting these down much less much less obnoxious than it could have been but as yeah as to whether or not I'm going to do them I don't know so I'll leave it there and I'll be back for at least one more video and yeah at, at, at the very worst an epilogue and uh, yeah I'll go spend some additional time on my by myself seeing whether or not I um, want to get these achievements but yeah at least one more video an epilogue to come so I hope to see you next time for that epilogue but uh, until then Cheerio. Okay, not quite cheerio. Quick addendum, because there's uh, two things I need to show off. One I completely forgot to show off, and one that I didn't know was there at the time I recorded the end of the last bit, but now I've figured out, or now when I went back in, actually was there, so meh. Anyway. <laughs> right, first thing was to show off my uh, save file, so as you can see, we already saw the death counter, but yeah, there it is again on the on the title screen, or on the, on the save select screen, 10,176, and just shy of 27 hours so yeah it has taken me a full day obviously not a day actual solid gameplay but uh, yeah over a day's worth of gameplay um to complete uh complete the uh state status one to 20 and uh yeah let's load up the game file obviously back to where we left off and uh yeah what i did when i was when i hovered over you was just pressed the up down button and it did and it switched there but of course if i just go over here and press the up down button it also does that. So what I should have done was talk to you. Uh, hello. Thank you. <laughs> well, I pressed I pressed X there and it didn't and it didn't do anything. What the hell? Anyway, hooray! You finished the game. What's this horse-like creature? I'm a pony. In this case, I'm the author of this game. Author? Game? Yes. In other words, goddess of this world. So when we say, "Oh my God," we actually mean you. Yeah, whatever. So why are you here, our goddess? Then why are you here? I just want to know what's in here. These 12 doors represent 12 hidden achievements. Those who can open these 12 doors, I'm here to award them. Seriously, what kinds of reward? Extra levels, of course. What? I thought I got the true ending. Extras are when I realise my old sounds... Old sounds cool ideas. Reali okay, realise my old... Sounds cool, I'd... Okay, maybe I just slightly misread that, but still not great. I will give you an achievement for finishing all of them. Only... Finsihed. Three of them now, so more levels are coming. Don't be sad, I will still give you this achievement in this version. Really? Yes, but beware. I will take it back once I update more levels. Well, that's a bit harsh. And seriously, I need more testers and feedback on this game, so if you're willing to help, that would be awesome. How can I help? Just email what you think about this game to sharpnelksu at gmail.com. I will definitely check it. And if you want to test new extras, email me how I can reach you to give you the updates you need. Sure. All right, then see you next time. Thanks for playing. So, uh, yeah, and you disappear. Okay. So, yeah, on that basis then, yes, if I can uh, sort out these achievements, then I absolutely will continue on. Because I didn't quite know what was, what was past there, whether it was just going to be... 
are just bragging rights for completing them, but it actually sounds like there are extra levels and extra and, and things and things to do. So, yes, assuming I can complete these achievements, then I absolutely will continue and will see the extra content. So, yeah, just wanted to say that at the end of end of at the end of the um, of having said goodbye previously. Now it really is goodbye. I will be back next time when I will when I hopefully uh, will start showing off uh, these secret achievements. Cheerio for reals this time.